Three charges are placed at corners of a square as shown in the figure. Find electric field at point A. First of all, let us label the rest of the corners as B, C and D. Now, charges at B and D are positive. Therefore, electric field due to B and electric field due to D will act like this. Charge at C is negative, hence electric field at C will act like this. EB and ED are acting perpendicular to each other, therefore we need to find the resultant first equals to ER and then we subtract that with EC to find the final value of electric field at point A. Now the given square is of 20 cm, therefore the diagonal will be 20 root 2 centimeters. Now EB will be equals to ED in terms of magnitude that will be equals to KQ by R square. Substituting the values and simplifying we get its value is 9 into 10 raised to 5 Newton per coulomb. Therefore the resultant vector ER due to EB and ED will be equals to under root EB square plus ED square. Substituting the values and simplifying we get the answer as 1.27 into 10 raised to 6 Newton per coulomb. Also EC will be equals to KQ by R square. Then we substitute the values for EC as well. That will be equals to minus 0 0.45 into 10 raised to 6 Newton per coulomb. So we have EC, we have ER which are acting in opposite direction. Therefore our resultant electric field will be given by E equals to ER plus EC. Substituting the values EC is negative so we take the difference. The electric field at point A will be equals to 0 0.82 into 10 raised to 6 Newton per coulomb and its direction will be along ER.